Hi all folks, this is Max from uh, GalaxyS2Root.com So I've got another ROM review of the a um, Omega AOKP ROM um, There's two versions, two flavors of uh, Omega This is the AOKP version, it's based off IMM76i um, It also comes with SIA kernel, so if you're du dual booting you don't have to um, separately flash um, the kernel over it um, It's very similar to Resurrection and uh, Hydrogen ICS ROM um, comes with ROM control that allows you to do all of, all of those things. Um, where is it? ROM control where you can do all of those things: change the UI, navigation bar, um, power menu option, power saver, lock screen, performance, everything you want to do. I'm not going to go over this. I'm just going to go over uh, some of the things that are different um, from the other ROMs. Otherwise, it's just going to get very repetitive and boring. Um, so let me just uh, walk you through some of the apps it comes with that's different from um, the other stuff. Um, first I noticed is the high quality MP3 recorder. Uh, I believe this records um, stuff in M MP3, which is kind of cool. Um, so I, I really love this feature because whenever I have thoughts or something and I can just go straight into my recording, it will make it into my MP3. Or if I'm, you know, hanging out with my DJ friends, I want to record this, you know, blip, 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 um, some scratching. I can do this really quickly and turn it into a microphone. I mean, there's other apps with it, but this is kind of cool that it comes with it. So we can just do that and play. Um, so I, I really love this feature because whenever I have thoughts or something, um, I used to actually I have this feature on my car, and I used to. Um, record my golf swing thoughts and uh, it's a great way to kind of record you know because if you don't have the time to re uh, write it or something if you're driving you can just hit this button and you have that idea and uh, it can work really well so that's it and uh, one of the coolest thing about this OKP ROM is it comes with three launchers you get the um, you get the uh, stock launcher, ICS launcher, Apex launcher or Nova launcher and it even comes with the home switcher uh, which means I can quickly switch to um, you can s quickly switch to um, Nova Launcher, so that's the Nova Launcher there. And uh, if you want to change it, um, so it's you know you can do clear defaults here, makes it very easy. Um, oh sorry, I think I have to actually go here, clear defaults, and go down and clear defaults like that. And now you have uh, you can choose all three Apex, Nova, or regular launcher. But I like Apex the most. Um, Nova and Apex, they're the best. You know, you can put different apps there with the, that launcher. And another thing I've noticed is different um, is also iOmega files, ICS. So this allows you to easily upgrade, I think. Um, oh, what is this? Oh, it's a kitchen. You can customize it. Oh, this is kind of cool. Boot animations, BIOS boot animation. Okay, so you can download, you can customize all these things um, with this app. It makes it really cool programs. Um, let me see, Chain Fire 3D. Wow, this is actually very useful. Um, so that's one thing different about this ROM is that you can easily customize, download this file and probably up, um, just uh, install it in Clockwork Mod Recovery. So it comes with all these modems. Um, very good feature about this ROM. Um, very handy. They'll come in handy. And uh, there was one other thing that I was different from other things. Oh, Rolla YouTube, you can download. Um, YouTube uh, files and uh, oh the other cool feature about this one is it has this uh, download all files feature so what what it does is um, what it does is when you download a file um, it will show you this download is complete and you can save it oh that's weird oh you actually have to save it to um, save it to actually download and I think this file is going to be very useful um, like let's say you want to download a couple files but you don't want to use up your HSPA 3G then you just you know you just wait till you get home 
until you have Wi-Fi, and then start downloading all these files, you know. And also, this comes in handy um, with all the downloads. You can see all the downloads. Um, that's kind of the only thing I, I, I see different from other ROMs, but those are kind of little useful features, and um, overall, this this is a pretty, pretty darn awesome ROM. I've been using uh, Omega ROM before, too. Um, so highly recommend that. Another great option if you want AOKP ROM control and uh, all those little things that you know could make life your life easier. And uh, it comes with a bunch of cool AOKP wallpapers like the one I have there. Um, like all these cool, cool Team Kang ones. Um, so definitely check it out. This is uh, pretty cool stuff. Um, Another great ROM you can try. The more ROMs you can try, the more options for you. And uh, in the end, you'll stick with one that works best for you. And each ROM has its own features, you know, advantages. And uh, I try to highlight them. But you know, if I didn't do a good job, um, go make your own YouTube channel. <laughs> anyway, um, thanks you guys for watching my video. If you have a Galaxy S2, don't forget to sign up for my email list at uh, galaxyS2root.com where we update you. Once or twice a week with uh, ROM reviews, tips, hacks, and more. And uh, just for you and me, not uh, we don't share your email with anyone else. And uh, if you're on YouTube, don't forget to hit that like button for me. And subscribe button up here. It helps me greatly. And share this with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, or Google+. And uh, we got the Galaxy S3 give out coming soon. I'm going to try to set it up over the weekend. Sorry. I should have set it up like last week, but it's just everything getting delayed, delayed. Um... So that's it, and stay high on Android, folks, and uh, don't be an iHore.